Good day, YouTube viewers. This is Peter speaking. I'm going to tell you my top five wish list TIE fighters. I want them to be as first order TIE fighters in the, from the Star Wars Legends. Number five. The TIE Sentinel makes number five of my top five TIE fighters. I want to be as first order TIE fighters of the Star Wars Canyon. The TIE Sentinel is a TIE fighter similar to the TIE Advance X-1 fighter and the TIE Aggressor fighter. It is armed with two turrets, one turret on top of the fighter to take out enemies from behind and one turret underneath the TIE fighter to take out enemies from below. The TIE Sentinel first appeared in Star Wars Legends Star Wars Galaxy Divided as an Imperial TIE Fighter, they were used during planetary invasion missions to destroy hidden rebel bases hiding on the planet to keep planets under Imperial control and defense fighters to protect hidden Imperial base that holds top secret valuable stuff. I really wanted the TIE Sentinel to be a First Order TIE Fighter in the Star Wars Canyon universe, see the TIE Sentinels attack a resistance fleet to protect another super weapon under construction, including protecting Kylo Ren's personal shuttle, escorting the Dark Jedi to the super weapon. That is why the TIE Sentinel makes number 5 of my top 5 wish list TIE Fighters. I want them to be as first order TIE fighters. Number 4 The TIE Punisher makes number 4 of my top 5 wish list I want to be as first order TIE fighters. The TIE Punisher is a heavy advanced TIE bomber fighter that has 4 pods each side of the fighter. It is equipped with deflector shields and no hyperdrive to travel at light speed. It first appeared in the Star Wars Legends as an Imperial TIE Bomber to destroy large Rebel Navy fleet and hidden Rebel bases hiding amongst the galaxy to keep star systems under Imperial control. I really wanted the TIE Punisher to be a First Order TIE Fighter in the Star Wars Canyon universe, see the First Order deploy TIE Punishers to destroy a civilization supporting the New Republic resistance. See how much devastation the TIE, Punish TIE Punishers can destroy. That is why the TIE Punisher makes number 4 of my top 5 TIE Fighters I wanted to be as First Order Fighters. Number 3 The TIE Hunter makes number 3 of my top 5 wishlist TIE Fighters. I want them to be as First Order TIE Fighters. The TIE Hunter is a TIE Fighter similar to the TIE Interceptor. It has S foils that can open and close just like a T-65 X-Wing. It is equipped with deflector shields to protect the fighter from enemy fighters attack and a hyperdrive that can travel up to light speed. The TIE Hunter first appeared in Star Wars Legends Rogue Squadron 3 as Imperial TIE Fighters. They were used as commando fighters during planetary invasion missions and protecting Imperial cargo ships that that holds valuable stuff for the Empire. I really wanted the TIE Hunters to be a First Order TIE Fighter in the Star Wars canon universe. See the TIE Hunters attack the Resistance fleet to protect another super weapon under construction. See how much devastation the TIE Hunters can destroy an entire resistance fleet. That is why the TIE Hunter makes number 3 of my top 5 wish list. I want them to be as First Order TIE Fighters. Number 2 
the drone tie fighter makes number two of my top five wish list fighters. I want them to be as first order tie fighters. The drone tie fighter is an artificial bell droid that can fly by itself. It is similar to the tie interceptor. It is equipped with twin ion drive and a laser turret. It has no hyperdrive to travel up to light speed and no deflector shields to defend itself from enemy fighters attack. It first appeared in Star Wars Legends Dark Empire as an Imperial battle droid. They were used during the Battle of Mon Calamari to protect the World Devastator super weapon from New Republic Army forces during Emperor Palpatine's reborn. I really wanted the drone TIE Fighters to be a First Order TIE Fighter in the Star Wars Canon universe. See the First Order deploy TIE Drone Fighters to attack a civilization world supporting the New Republic. See the drone TIE Fighters devastate an entire civilization world. That is why the drone TIE Fighter makes number two of my top five wish lists. I want them to be as first order TIE Fighters. Number one. The TIE Phantom makes the number one TIE Fighter. I really wanted to be a first order TIE Fighter of my top five wish list TIE Fighters. The TIE Phantom is a TIE Fighter similar to the TIE Reaper and TIE Defender. It has three solar panel wings each side of the TIE Fighter. It is equipped with deflector shields to protect the fighter from enemy fighters attack and a hyperdrive to travel up to light speed and a cloaking device to camouflage the fighter to attack enemies from behind without getting detected. It also has a self-destruct me mechanism inside the fighter to blow itself up, not to fall under enemy hands. The TIE Phantom first appeared in Star Wars Legends Star Wars Rebel Assault 2 as an Imperial fighter. They were used during stealth attack missions to test their new prototype fighter, hoping they can crush the Rebel Alliance. Until a small group of Rebels destroyed the TIE Phantom factory, housing thousands of new TIE Phantoms fighters. The last TIE Phantom self-destruct by itself, itself at the hidden Rebel base so the Rebel Alliance cannot examine the TIE Phantom stealth technology making the TIE Phantom technology gone forever. I really wanted the TIE Phantoms to be a First Order TIE Fighter in the Star Wars Canyon universe. See the TIE Phantoms ambush the Resistance fleet to protect another super weapon under construction. See how much devastation the TIE Phantoms can destroy a New Republic Resistance fleet. That is why the TIE Phantom makes number one of my top five Wish list I want them to be as first order TIE fighters. Thank you for watching my top 5 wish list TIE fighters I want as first order TIE fighters. Please leave a comment you want me to make a new video or subscribe to see more videos. Hope we see those Star Wars Legends TIE fighters become first order TIE fighters in Star Wars canon universe. Peter out.